I went to grab the sleeping bags for the kids. So this is what's happening so far. Um, my brother and Sharon just had a baby. So congrats to them. Uh, my mom and I are helping to watch Colin. And we slept over there at my mom's house last night. He did great. Such a happy baby. Haven't had any tears. Went to sleep great. Um, this morning when I woke up, I was like, shoot, my mom doesn't drink coffee. So she had no coffee at her house, so that's probably why I'm tired. I did have four pieces of coffee candy, though, just to tie me over. And I did stop by the bakery to get some buns and also to get a cup of coffee because I was, like, really needing it. And then I think tonight... I did tell the boys they could sleep over at my mom's. Um, so I think that's the plan today. I wasn't like committed to it, but I do remember telling them casually like, cause they wanted to sleep over last night. And I was like, no, you can't, it's a school night. Um, but I was like, oh, but maybe on Friday, you know, just very casually. And I think they have it in their minds that they're gonna sleep over tonight. So I think that's happening. But I didn't plan anything <laughs> for that, so we have like no clothes or anything like that. Um, I actually went home just to grab the vlogger and a couple of things for myself. And I forgot contact solution. That's fine. So anyway, I think um, maybe power after work, he will go back home to get the kid stuff. And I'll just ask him to grab um, some contact solution for me. All right, right on time for car line. You know, I wasn't coming from the house. So I was like, very like, is this enough time? Is that enough time? Because I had to make a couple stops. But yeah, right on time. I think the bell is about to ring in about a minute. And then they'll start coming out. Oh, this is the coffee that I bought from 85. I'm feeling better already. I had to grab some clothes too because I don't know why I was thinking like well I didn't know how many days I would be staying over there so I only <laughs> I only brought enough for like one night and I didn't even bring like any going out clothes this is what I'm wearing is just like house clothes you know like pajamas like stuff I just lounge around sleep in so um I had a I had a pick up some like regular you know tops and stuff oh, actually I could have grabbed a couple more pairs of pants it's fine. I don't care. This one is the um, instant coffee that I grabbed from my house too. I didn't even have time to throw this stuff in a bag. I just, I just grabbed it all in my hands and I ran out the house. Hello. Hello. Yes, I know. Giant chair. Yeah, you have to sit on that side. I got Colin's car seat in the back. Okay, sit down, buckle. You're right. Uh, moving. Giant chair next to me. I am moving. How was your guys' this day? Good. Yeah, what made it good? I knew I was going to get picked up by you and we were going to head to Pool Boy's house mm -hmm. afterwards. Yes. Finally, I had to sit in the middle. And I got some buns. Yeah. Because I didn't have coffee, so I had to get some coffee. So I might as well grab some buns. <laughs> Did you guys eat the sponge cake? It was delicious. Okay. Did you guys finish it yep. all? Yes, it was delicious. The boys want their buns now. Uh, what do you want, Ryan? Choco latte. Okay, there's two choco buns in there. What do you say, Ryan? What are you getting today? Choco buns. Oh, okay. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome. I knew you guys would like the choco buns. It's like one of your favorite. Mm -hmm. Chocolate. Mmm. Cool. Mm. Here's a good one. Did you guys eat your lunch? 
I ate garlic bread and milk. Garlic bread and milk, and this is a nope. You didn't eat the garlic bread? They didn't have garlic bread when I got there. Oh. And plus, in my opinion, the garlic bread is soggy. Oh. Good. Spaghetti too, but... Oh, spaghetti and garlic bread? That sounds delicious. It's not. Really? Yeah. My kids don't like spaghetti. You're right, you didn't have the spaghetti? Oh, it's so messy. Well, messy, but you eat it with a fork. Why is that messy? That's just gross, okay? Trust me. Usually, usually um, school spaghetti is very soft, right? A little like mushy, like overcooked. How was your guys' night? I huh? slept really well. Yeah, what you? Yeah. PJ. I get up in the morning. Really? Yeah. Had a hard time? PJ, I heard you got a splinter last night. Did Dad take it out? Is it still in there? You didn't tell the, much, though. You didn't tell the nurse? I told Dad <laughs> to tell you to yeah, tell... Yeah, he told me. To tell the nurse. He you didn't? He told me that if it hurt him to tell the nurse. Oh, but it didn't hurt you? No. Yeah, so Power actually texted me last night and he was like, PJ has a splinter, he's crying, where are the tweezers, did you take them? And I'm like, yeah, I took them because it's in my like travel bag. So I had taken it with me and I was like, uh, I don't know, to, like, you know, I had these little like splinter out thingies, like, I don't know what they're called. They're like they little blades. Needles. Yeah, they're like blades with like a sharp pointy thing. And they're supposed to help get splinters out, but he couldn't, um... I guess he couldn't do it, it just right? hurt. He was poking at my flesh and tearing my skin. Okay, I'm sure he was being very gentle. But that's what he was doing. <laughs> Your dad said, man, I bet the neighbors thought I was torturing my son or something. He was. <laughs> oh, good job, Uriah, doing your homework. How you doing? Any questions? Oh, good job. Oh, Paul wants to see you. Huh? Want to come up? Uh, oh, it's okay. You want to come in? Poor ma. I'm poor ma. Hey. Poor ma. Poor ma. Poor ma. Poor ma. Poor Oi. Oi. Oh, okay. Colin's eating some bread that I bought from earlier. Oh, he likes your hat. Your bow. Oh, we'll he likes putting it on and off. Oh, yeah. He likes taking it off. He likes taking it I'm off. I'm Homer. Mm -hmm. okay. How much is a nickel worth? Five cents. I'm Homer. Yeah, Wait, cents. so five, ten. Yeah, so they want you to count by five. Oh. Easy? Is that too spicy for you? No. You're right, I wanted the spicy sausage bun. I already bought, I only bought one. I thought maybe PJ was gonna want it, but he actually didn't want it, and Uriah wanted it. What should we have for dinner? In and out. How about um, the hat? <laughs> I was going to say, not the hat. We're not even by the hat. The hat is by our house. We're not by our house. I am back. Finally reunited with Annie. Right in and out. Cause, it smells so good. You know, everything's all out of whack here now. Well, I didn't want my mom to have to cook dinner for us. And I don't want to cook dinner. <laughs> so, I'm going to buy things. The problem with this in and out is the line is so long. You see it? Like, wrapping around. So we're just going to go in and pick it up. Finally got the food. We went inside to save time. That took forever. I think either way it probably would have taken yeah. a while. We are back. The kids are so excited Yay! for In-N-Out. Hey! Are you eating? Everyone's chowing down. Food is good, but a little cold. I'm so hungry. Minutes one. Um, there's some in this bag for him. Looks like we are winding down for the night. Colin's already being put down and I went to grab the sleeping bags for the kids. Do you really want to sleep here? You, you don't want to be closer to the wall over there? I don't really care. <laughs> I mean, I'm next to this wall. I know. 
You guys are tired already? No. You guys need to, yeah. um, well, you guys need to brush teeth. Dad already left your toothbrush and your toothpaste in the bathroom. Okay, you can brush and get ready for bed. What time is it? I don't think it's quite nine yet. But I mean, I'm tired too, so. Okay, night night guys. Mm -hmm. We'll see you guys tomorrow.